Thanks for logging into MyFoxHurricane.com. I'm meteorologist Dave Osterberg, and things have been quiet after that early season named storm that we have. However, the computer models are thinking it may change a little bit toward the latter portion of next week. Let's get into it. July climatology, of course, still favors the Gulf of Mexico and the Caribbean, but does include parts of the southeast coast of the United States. For, for you know, if you're going to get a storm, these are the areas where it is likely to form. Right now, nothing. It's quiet out there. The eastern Pacific has been very active, on the other hand. But we're starting to see a little shift. And at the end of our next seven days, you go toward the middle to latter portion of next week, you can see with the European model that a weak low wants to form in the northeast Gulf off the Florida Panhandle, maybe over toward Alabama. So the potential is there sort of at the end of this cold front for a low to form and develop into something tropical. The other thing that we're noticing is that as we get toward, you know, day five, day six, day seven, you can see the tropical moisture increase throughout the eastern Gulf throughout everybody in the state of Florida. Notice that, that red there. So that'll be pouring moisture on shore with the potential for some decent rain amounts, including, look at that, that's the rainfall forecast for the next seven days. So the Northeast Gulf does bear watching next week for the potential for development. Until then, though, you have yourself a safe weekend and keep checking back in with us.